I'm Maura, this is Jewelry Etc. And today I'm going to be busting open this geode. I'm so excited about this. I've had this for a while and I just haven't gotten to it. Um, I'm doing a rock show. Today is rock show. Um, <laughs> today is the 17th, I think, of September 2020. And uh, my rock show is the Saturday. So this is one of the things I'm gonna have for sale are a couple of geodes. And I wanted to see what was inside of them before I sold them to you because why wouldn't I? Uh, plus, how can you resist the temptation to find out what's inside? So for those of you that don't know what a geode is, in a very simple explanation, it's basically a round rock with a giant cavity inside of it. And within the cavities are minerals that grow into a crystal formation. So kind of over time, water seeps into the rock and flows back out. Every once in a while, you'll get water inside of them. But, um, now that I've ever seen that. But I, my understanding is that it, they get trapped in crystals sometimes too. Um, that's on my, I hope to own it one day list, is a crystal with water inside of it. Anyway, totally getting off topic. Um, so <laughs> the mineral that grows within the geode will depend entirely on what minerals were present in the water at the time it was in the rock. So, I don't know what's in here. I have another one in there that's got a little hole in the side, a little peekaboo hole, and it just looks like a, like a white, really fine white druzy crystal of some sort, uh, an agate or quartz, more or less the same thing, but anyway. Um, but I don't know about this one, so I figured we'd find out together. Sorry, my yard is a wreck behind me. They're my, they're my geese and some ducks. Anyway, they're hanging out. The geese keep getting out of the fence. This is not the farming channel, this is the jewelry channel. Let me get back to the, the rock. Um, yeah, so let's bust this baby open. It's a little wet out here, so I don't know where I'm gonna do this or how I'm gonna do it without getting my camera wet, but we'll give it a try. So, uh, let's do it. All right, here's the deal. Hopefully you can hear me okay. This is the geode, and don't mind my cat. That's Heiser, he's our farm cat. Um, and he loves attention, and I'm on his level right now, so he wants to say hi. <laughs> <laughs> Anywho, this has like a completely flat bottom as you can see, so my goal is going to be to try to cut it around like this side, and hopefully I don't hit the cat. And uh, our tools today are this hammer and this chisel. So I'm going to attempt to kind of chisel around the line I, wanna, I want it to break at, and uh, we'll see if this works. And hopefully I don't drop the freaking hammer on my camera. Because that would be a catastrophe. But hey. So my understanding is you have to do this like pretty gradually. In order to get it to break where you want it to break. Look how pretty it is. There's clear crystal quartz in there and it is just spectacular. It didn't break like I wanted it to. I kind of hit it really hard just to get it open because I was getting uh, slightly sick of knocking it on all sides and having it roll around on me. But I'm not mad. That is really, really pretty, especially this cluster. Let me turn it around. Oh my gosh, I love that! That cluster at the bottom. Ah, oh, that's beautiful! How cool is that? Alright, I'm really pumped. If you guys are interested in breaking open your own geode, I will have these for sale on Saturday. Hope to see you all there. Thanks so much for watching, and I hope to see you on the next one. Bye!